Preparing illustration for After Effects in Adobe Illustrator You need to group all the shapes in separate layers to be able to work with file later on. You should group it in a way to easily animate it in prospect. Usually I try to divide an illustration as strongly as possible, even if I'm not planning to animate its separated parts. Then I name the layers. It will help to recognize them in future. There is no sense in naming the shapes, because you won't see it after export. Also, you have to make a check on supported features so as nothing is dropped during export. I created 9 different files to demonstrate supported and unsupported features. So, a circle with fill easily converts into shape layer. But you could face some problems if you would like to add stroke. In this case, you have to go to Add Stroke. Circle with stroke is being perfectly converted to, but there you can get into trouble adding fill. You can fix it as well through Add Fill. You can easily convert circle with fill and stroke into shape. Gradient fill isn't a supported feature, you will have to edit it anew. Clipping mask is being dropped either. You can find three groups inside the layer. You can convert a circle with a brush stroke into shape quite easily, but it would be no longer a stroke, but a pile of groups. The stroke is also being converted into shape, as in case of a circle with applied width tool. Here we got two merge path groups. Gradient stroke isn't supported during converting. The opacity would be dropped, you'll have to reset it. The bodice would become a size of a whole composition. Sometimes you can face a problem of the fill and stroke being divided. My way to fix it is to delete a group with a fill and add it through the Add fill. The gradient is unsupported. If you have a brush or width tool on stroke, then it would be converted into shape. Clipping masks and opacity are being dropped. So, these are the main rules that I stick to while preparing my illustration. Thanks for watching, I hope it was helpful.